Oh, good morning, tubers. It is a, uh, it's May 6th, May 4th. I don't know what day it is. Uh, we're going to go, uh, we're going to go do some stuff at the parents. Uh, Dad wants to go get a log splitter. And, uh, I think Mom wants the yard mode and some other shenanigans done. Also, I'm putting a new carburetor on Dad's lawnmower, so... We'll have a decent day of busyness. I'm going to have to put you guys on the charger on the way out. Got my mower and everything back here. That's what I love about the Explorer. Everything in here fits snugly. And if it starts to rain or anything, it's all covered up. It's my compromise. I would like to have a canopy for that truck, but I, I like the truck without the canopy, but I like having the canopy, so... That's why I have the Explorer, so screw cars. Anyways, I was going to do a live video today, but I'm going to be out and about, so we'll do just a normal video. And, uh, let me break on. It's just, just cylinder number two. Um, I got to, I don't know if I'm going to see Adam today, but he's going to give me the, because of his work schedule, um, I'm not I can't get him to go with me to scrap this thing I have to get not just a title from him but I have to get a bill of sale so he can release interest of it and then that way I can take it and scrap it so that's gonna be coming up I don't know if it's gonna be it, it won't be this week it'll be next week um, but yeah I'll go get the tow dolly from grandpa we'll hook her up to the old truck there or maybe we'll even see if the Explorer will do it so yeah that's gonna be coming up I think um, we're gonna we're gonna mess around with that and then uh, Holler off for scrap and see how much you get. I actually have some stuff that I can probably cram in there that needs to go too. So, yeah. Anyways, Tubes, I'm going to put you on the charger because you're about to die. And then um, I'm going to uh, roll on out. Need a ditch, which yeah, yeah. All right, where are the lock splitters? Oh, oh my God! Hundred bucks for an axe. Even fifty dollars for the splitting hatchet. You'd have to be pissed if you split that cast. Well, yeah, split. I mean, hundred bucks—that's <laughs> a lot of money. 160 bucks for a little pruner, a wee little pruner guy. It's freaking got gas in it too, man. Yeah, I'll come in here. This is nice. Cool. Is like... Okay, I know that one's got gas in it. I'm just like, son, son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah, freaking Coastal Farm Ranch. Well, uh, splitter. Well, actually, we want to find that uh, four-way. Yeah. It was only for the uh, handyman, hand, dirty hands model. Well, the fact that they have a splitter can make yeah. it, so. Yeah. This is going to be some fun. Freaking log splitter? Are you kidding? This is the best toy I've ever bought. <laughs> the only thing we might add later is um, a sheath. Okay. Yeah, a sheath over this so you, if it ever pops, it doesn't blow you open. So yeah, I'm like, okay, when the kid hooked this up, he put one chain on one side, straight across, and this straight across, and I'm like, nah, 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 you crisscross it, double it up so it doesn't rub on the ground. This is all you get for a, I a nut and a bolt, I'll probably get a little pin for it. I mean, you're not going to move it around a whole lot, it's going to stay here at the house. But if if, you, if it does get moved, um, we'll want a better pin for that. And I would probably put some lights on this. And probably next time I just put my uh, 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 trailer lights on, the magnetic ones. 
probably have to reset. Go for it! This log splitter is a lot of fun. <laughs> it's got a <clears throat> Briggs and Scrapping. It's actually it's not bad. It, it's a pretty good engine. It's not working very hard to move that ramp through some of the crap we're giving it. We're giving her a pretty hot supper, so um, it's working pretty good. But you know, if you can just kind of messing with it, it it really doesn't feel any it, it oh I was just telling the tubers I feel like I've you know we've got a Harbor Freight engine on here that's <laughs> that's uh yeah we got we got quite a bit of quite a bit here already done uh oh let's walk through it yeah, we did had a whole bunch of rounds and stuff over there. We're getting dealt with. I'm, all of this will be a couple hours. Yeah, I mean, the bigger ones will have to deal with sugar, but I think we can get most of it up on the thing and do it. Yep. And we fire it up. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do a little, yeah, three minutes an hour or so. Far good. People will relax without going for the rest of the night. Yeah, yeah, we're kind of the nuisance of the neighborhood yeah. right now. Yeah. Hey, we need to get this done though. Yeah. Mission on. Fire in a hole!
Go for it. Have some fun. Well, Tippers, that's enough for today. We got quite a bit split. We're about more than halfway down with all the wood. We got a few rounds that we're going to do. We're going to try and do tomorrow. And then after that, it's just stacking it. So, anyways, I'm going to start heading home. I'm pretty tired. So, yeah, anyways. Thanks for watching, and we'll, uh, we'll see you later. Stay tuned for later this week. i got some stuff to do on the truck. I've got um, well, the Dana 44 axle on my truck needs a little more service. So we'll have a video on that, and uh, we'll catch you next time. Oh, also there's some 4BT stuff i got to do too, so we'll do that. Later.